Okay, it's Scott Simmons and we're back. Now there's an O-ring in here in this top mount. This is the thing that screws on at the top there. And you've got to pull that one out. I've used this little screwdriver. And if you've noticed, I now have these fancy dancy uh, surgical gloves on. The reason is you don't want to although there's probably oil on these bloody o-rings and I'm going to touch the uh, you don't want to get oil, body oil or any oil now I've probably got oil from my uh, from the o-rings but you're not supposed to get any oil on the UV bulb itself so I'm not going to try to touch it I hate wearing these surgical gloves, I don't know how surgeons do it but I guess you get used to anything but you've got to get that little o-ring Oops, seated back in that little tiny slot. Okay, and then you'll get a good seal. Now the trick with this thing is not to do it up too tight, which I've done before, and you shatter the glass. And then you have to go back down to mow it and spend another $84 or $94. So now I've used some cleaner, and it's still a little bit yellow, but it's basically clean. The thing is, don't forget about the spring. You've got to put the spring in the bottom. If you don't put the spring in, it doesn't work. Now then the other O-ring you slide it on here. Oops. And uh, it's kind of like a giant condom. And then you put this sucker right up. And you don't want to go too hard. But, oh, fuck. It's easy to break it. Because you've got to push see the the rubber sits right the uh, o-ring sits right there and the glass slides up and so it's all a matter of finesse how hard do you push it so anyways I'm going to struggle with this try not to curse too much on YouTube I don't want to do that and uh, pop it on it, come on. Well if you do break it then you get a real clean one. So you know you wonder sometimes who designs this stuff. Obviously the company wants you to break it. It's like come on break it you can break it. It's only another ninety four dollars. And I'm so cheap it's like why would I want to spend ninety four dollars when I don't have to? I mean, it's not as if you're going to get this huge benefit. A new glass cylinder for your overpriced UV light bulb to sit in. Anyways, I'm going to struggle with this thing. Like you're trying to push, can you see that? It's kind of hard, there's a little, that glass has got to go push that O-ring down and then ride over it friggin almost impossible to do without breaking it. Highly recommend not buying a rainbow system. It's their crap. Although I haven't had any problems with it, but it's like could you make it more difficult? Like I just watched the YouTube video on the Honeywell one. Now that's a slick looking unit. Oh, this thing's gonna break for sure. I'll bet you five bucks I'd break it right now. Son of a gun. And you, you know, you're, it's like trying to push a glass light bulb. I mean, okay, maybe I don't have it in the little slot. Which it's, look, it's almost impossible to see. You know what's in there? But I mean, how much strength is in that glass there, and how hard do you want to push on it? Okay. Try a little bit of spit on there. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Almost! Oh! You just know it's going to go crack! What? Oh, okay, I'm going to try another method now. This is method number three. Um, well, no, that won't work. Slide the O-ring on and slide it down together. I'm going to try that. And if that fails, I'm actually going to read the instructions. I might stop the tape at this point, or the tape, the uh, 
the video this will be part number three and go over the instructions even though it's against my better judgment to read instructions you know if my wife was down here she'd read all the instructions and then she'd wait till I'm I broken it she'd, then she'd go well it said to do it the other way I mean why do women like to read instructions and why do men just like to do it anyways I'll get my screwdriver or screw out and uh, wreck that o-ring okay I got the o-ring out this is the second method I'm going to put the o-ring over the glass and I'm going to try to slide the whole issue in oh that son of a it's not in though all it did yeah I just pushed it down look at that hey oh there's two sides of o-rings son of a gun I should have remembered that from last year Okay, I'm going to read the instructions here. I'll be right back.